Hello and welcome to this demo about the Banner 9 faculty grade entry function. You will arrive at the faculty grade entry, Final Grades, where the tab for the final grades will be highlighted. If you need to enter midterm grades, click the Midterm Grades tab. Note that all courses you taught in previous semesters will be listed, as well as the courses you are currently instructing, and courses for future semesters. The courses are sorted by CRN, but you can sort any column in ascending or descending order by clicking on the arrows at the top of the column. Note that you can sort by one column at a time only. If you teach many courses, sorting may not be enough to find specific courses you need. Click in the search box and enter a search term. If you are looking for all courses for a particular term, we suggest searching by the term name and year. For example, to see all courses in Summer 2019, enter Summer 2019 in the search box. To remove the search, simply delete the search information from the search box. The Grading Status column shows your progress towards entering your grades. Completed indicates that all grades have been entered. In progress means some grades, but not all, have been entered which may include grades of W, or withdrawn students. Not started indicates that no grades have been entered. The rolled column is the grades that have been rolled to academic history. Until the grades have been rolled, you may still make changes. To begin entering grades, click on the class you will be grading. Then scroll down to see the roster for the class. Click on the drop-down box for each student to enter a grade. If there is no drop-down available, it is either because grading is not yet open for the course or the grade has been rolled to academic history. Entry of last to 10 date is not required. You can continue to enter grades, but please note that you do not need to enter all grades at once. When you are finished entering the grades, scroll to the bottom of the page. Note that the reset button will clear all unsaved grades. Click save to submit the grades. A confirmation message will appear on the screen after you have saved. You also may import your grades from an Excel file. The Excel file must include columns for the banner term code, the course CRN, each student's fee number, and each student's final grade. If any of the required columns are missing from your Excel file, be sure to add them. From the grade entry roster, click on the tool icon on the top right and click import. Click Browse to search your computer for the Excel file. And then click Upload. After the upload is complete, click Continue. Look at the preview file and confirm accuracy by clicking Continue. Using the Map field drop-down boxes, mark the four required fields, which are Term Code, Student ID, CRN, and Final Grade. This tells Banner which Excel file columns to import into the final grade sheet. Click Continue. You may then either download the validation report to look for errors, or click the Continue button to finish the upload. When the import is complete, click Finish. You should now reopen the grade roster to ensure the grades were loaded. This concludes our training for Banner 9 Faculty Grade Entry. 